Alrighty guys, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are all doing well. Now I wanted to answer a question in this video. Um, basically, is it worth it to start a home gym right now? Basically in November 2020, about eight months after the uh, national lockdown in the United States. Now, if you guys haven't been following the news, there has been a huge spike in COVID cases, which basically means that the deaths due to COVID are gonna spike here probably in a few weeks. Hopefully not, but unfortunately that's kind of what has been happening around the world. So um, basically in Europe, same thing, the COVID cases have uh, significantly spiked here in Colorado. Um, we're basically breaking new records every single day. We're, we're hitting PRs in terms of COVID cases, which of course isn't a PR you ever wanna break, but unfortunately that is what is going on. So basically the lockdown that we had in March uh, was was tough for a lot of people. Now, for me personally, fitness is a huge part of my life. I have to work out um, a few times a week at least. It helps with so many different things. It's a stress reliever. Um, you feel good physically, you feel good mentally. It's just, it's just become a huge part of my life and obviously a habit. And I'm sure a whole bunch of you guys can relate to that as well. Now, it's good. It would be a good thing if the government puts a kind of a national lockdown um, because hopefully it will reduce the, the amount of cases and hopefully that will reduce the amount of deaths due to COVID as well. Um, but the thing that sucks about it is obviously the gyms will mo more than likely shut down as well. Now, if the gyms uh, shut down, obviously people without a home gym are not going to be able to work out. And that's going to be unfortunate, especially uh, just like I said earlier, if fitness is a big part of your life and working out is a big part of your daily routine. So if I did not have a home gym, I would look into building a home gym right now. Like at this specific moment, I would go on to uh, Rev Fitness, Rogue, Sorenex, whatever fitness uh, company has equipment right now, I would go and try to get as much stuff as I can. Now I'm a huge advocate of Rev Fitness. I basically have uh, decorated my whole gym with rep fitness equipment and I've absolutely loved it because of course it's great quality and they offer it at a cheap price now for a student like me I don't have a huge budget so I need uh, good quality things for a cheap price and basically rep fitness hits the spot so I'm gonna go ahead and link rep fitness in the description and in the comment section below and make sure to check out rep fitness they have been restocking so much over the past few days and, and for the rest of November they're gonna restock a lot of other equipment as well so be on the lookout make sure to check every single day a few times a day especially if you're really, really looking into building a home gym. Now, aside from COVID and aside from a national lockdown or whatever kind of lockdown uh, they decide to do, having a home gym has uh, honestly been a great experience. Obviously, it's had its uh, challenges, but it has a lot of pros as well. It has a lot of advantages as well. Um, and one of the main things for me is that I'm able to, to basically stay with my family, stay in the house. So if the family needs me, I'm, I'm basically just a few steps away. I don't have to take the trip all the way down to the gym and back. So it saves a lot of time. I'm able to study more. I'm able to basically be more efficient with my time and more productive with my time. So that has been a huge help, especially during this semester. So if you're one of those people that don't really have a lot of free time, I would also highly recommend looking into a home gym for you guys. And honestly, just over the past few months, the home gym feel has kind of just grown on me. I'm able to customize it and take care of it how I want. It's become a hobby in itself. Obviously working out in fitness is a hobby of mine, but now building a home gym has become a hobby as well. Um, and a lot of other home gym owners feel the same way. You want to get certain equipment in your home gym. You want to make your home gym look a certain way, feel a certain way. And it's just very customizable. It's a, it's a honestly it becomes a hobby at some point. It has been great. It has been nothing but positive. Um, obviously I talk about a whole bunch of problems with uh, the garage gym and my other videos and you guys can go ahead check those out but aside from all those problems I've, I've honestly just grown to enjoy the, the garage gym and the home gym feel with all of its pros and cons so uh, for me personally if somebody if a good friend of mine asked should I start a home gym right now in November 2020 with the COVID cases spiking I would say 100% yes. If you have the budget and if you have the space to build a home gym, I would highly 100% recommend building a home gym right now. Now, before I end this video, I'm just gonna go ahead and run down through a couple pieces of equipment that I have. If you guys are new to the channel and maybe you haven't seen my garage gym yet, um, it's very dirty right now, so excuse the mess. I'm gonna clean it here probably in a few minutes after I finish the video. But basically, the rack that you guys see behind me is a rip. Let me move out of the frame. That is the Rep PR5000 V2. Um, the barbell is from Rogue, it's a Rogue Ohio bar. And then the plates are also from Rep Fitness. I've, I did a review on the plates. I did a review on the 
PR5000 and I've also done a review on the GHD. So if you guys wanna check them out, I'll also link it in the description uh, below. But long story short, if you guys don't have a lot of time to watch a whole bunch of YouTube videos, um, basically every piece of equipment that I've had um, has been perfect except for the Rep FV5000. If you guys haven't watched the video, basically the bench came with a slanted frame. Rep was able to fix it and send me a brand new bench press with a perfect frame. So other than that, the quality has been great for the past uh, you know, few months. I've basically tried to abuse uh, the, the equipment. I haven't really been bathing the equipment around. I'm basically just smashing the plates. I'm smashing the J cups and the rack and all that stuff, moving it around. Um, and everything has been perfect. So again, if you guys are looking for some quality equipment at a cheap price, I'd highly recommend checking out Rep Fitness. If Rep is out of stock and you really need equipment right then and there, and Rogue has some equipment, Rogue, of course, is a very popular brand. They make great stuff um, and a whole bunch of other brands that you guys can look up and just basically try to find some equipment for yourself uh, right now. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Inshallah, I'm gonna be actually showing training footage in the garage gym here in the next few videos. So if you guys are new to the channel, I would really appreciate it. If if you hit the subscribe button and if you enjoyed the video don't forget to drop a like and inshallah i'll see you guys in the next one peace